my relationship with Nepal started all in the year 1965, when at the age of 22, I traveled overland from Switzerland all the way to Nepal. You can say I was a hippie. In my case, I was looking for something which would give a purpose to my life. In 1965, I started instantly to take systematically photographs of literary stone sculptures. I have these fascinations. And for me, it's the visual aspect of religion which inspires me. First of all, it is a documentation. Because of the documentation, dealing and reeling in Nepali stone sculptures has stopped. That's all I can say. And eventually, they will also stop stealing images in Nepal from the temples and sites because nobody will buy it. With almost 2,800 statues documented about 10 times larger than the, early, than the largest book before. It could not have been done without collaboration of local people. First of all was Shukra Sagar Shrestha, I knew for many years, and he helped many foreigners to start doing research here. Sunil Dongol, he provided thousands of photographs, which are in the book or on the SD card. It, these books is the highest quality printing in the world, and they gave me guarantee of 300 years shelf life. This is my gift to Nepal. I'm of a generation of thieves who cleared out the world, just taken, stolen everything. And I want to give something back. And this is my gift to Nepal now and in the future. And that gives me happiness that I can do something like